So just before I went to work last night, I said something dumb and had the great opportunity of mulling that over throughout my entire shift. What I had said was that uh, one of my closest friends just happened to be a Christian. And that's not at all accurate. He doesn't just happen to be a Christian. It's a very important part of his life, and it's a very important part of his perspective on life and the world around him. Uh, he and his family are probably the people whose faith mean the most to them of everyone that I know in my life. And what I found when I thought about it more is that I was guilty of the thing that I am so frustrated with lately, which is uh, conflating equality and sameness. He's not the same as me. His family is not the same as me. Um, I believe that they are good people, and I like to believe that I'm a good person, but that has nothing to do with are being the same. And why I say this frustrates me is because I've noticed that essentially every movement for equality over the last hundred years or so um, has begun with a black is beautiful or gay pride sort of thing that seeks to destigmatize whatever it is about marginalized groups that makes them different. That's good. I think that those things should be destigmatized. But what happens after that is sort of an appeal to the norm um, that says, listen, this one tiny thing that, that sets us apart actually doesn't even matter. This is dangerous, and this is damaging to equality movements in a number of ways, because it can't be effective forever. Uh, for instance, that may have worked with uh, black Americans, it may work with gay and lesbian Americans as the appeal turns into we're just like you, we have the same values, we want to get married, etc. But there are so many marginalized groups and so many marginalized cultural groups that that that's that does no service to. I mean consider all of the other letters in the initialism LGBTQ. Like Bisexual people aren't just like anyone. Uh, transgendered people especially are not just like the norm. They will never be just like the norm. And so insisting that we should all be equal because we're all the same doesn't help transgendered people at all. It also doesn't help the asexual community, which may not want to partner whatsoever, um, especially not seek marriage equality, it, they're not going to have the same values as people who do seek those things. They are different. Equality has nothing to do with sameness. It has to do with um, the one unifying thing that's true of these people seeking equality in America, at least. Um, a, they are humans, and B, they are U.S. citizens. So I apologize for saying that my friend was just happened to be a Christian, because he doesn't just happen to be a Christian. Um, I don't just happen to be about 80% gay. I, I don't just happen to be white. There aren't, uh, these aren't circumstances which are thrust upon us that, uh, don't impact our lives whatsoever. They're choices and they are, uh, sometimes inherent in us but they color our experience, they color our perspective immensely. So I am going to make a huge effort to stop uh, referring to people as just anything, uh, or to say that they just happen to be something, or part of a certain group, because that, that really misses the point of whatever that experience is. It devalues it. Um, equality is not sameness. And I really appreciate that America can celebrate diversity. I really appreciate celebrating diversity in my own life. And I failed at that last night. And I don't like that. So I'm not going to do that anymore. But what I am going to do is see you later.